So today I have some great news for any BSD users out there who like to game. Recently the Linux Linuxulator, which for those who don't know is BSD's compatibility layer that lets it run Linux programs, was found to be able to run Windows programs using Proton in Steam. This new discovery opens up a whole new slew of possibilities for users wanting to game on BSD. Although with that said, definitely do not go out and switch to BSD for all of your gaming needs just yet as this whole thing is a little bit fiddly. Steam is not designed to work in a Linux container on BSD, so compatibility issues are sure to arise. I, for example, couldn't even get Steam working on BSD at all, even when I followed exact instructions from a member of the Ghost BSD Telegram. However, many people have got this setup working. For example, a user by the name of A6166A uploaded a video of themselves running several games on BSD using the Linux Elator and Proton, which before I talk about the footage, I'd like to give a huge thanks to them for letting me use their footage. Now sadly all of the footage they captured is at a low frame rate, but this is only because they were recording through OBS Studio. According to them, performance was actually on par with what they were getting in Linux, which is really impressive. Now as we can see, they got some fairly lightweight games working and everything looks like it's working really well. There's a DXVK menu in the corner of their gameplay showing that DXVK works under BSD, which is really impressive and in fact shows that in many ways the hardware support on BSD is just as good as it is on Linux. Now, I'll let you see a little bit of gameplay footage, but you should really go and check out the original video too. There's about 20 minutes of footage of these games running, and it's really impressive to see. So I'll have a link to that in the description. Once I've shown you some of the gameplay footage that I've got here, I'll come back and tell you the most impressive thing about all of this. So I said once I'd shown you the gameplay footage I'd come back and show you the most impressive thing about all of this and indeed I will. Without a doubt the thing that I found most impressive about this whole thing is a virtually brand new game. A full AAA game running under BSD. In A6166A's video they show some footage of No Man's Sky running under BSD and I have to say it's really really impressive. The game looks great and it's really impressive knowing that a brand new game a brand new AAA game is running under BSD. Now as cool as that is, I do have to say, definitely don't go out and delete your Linux partitions and switch to BSD. Compatibility is still nowhere near what you can get on Linux, but I do have to say this is all very impressive and I can't wait to see where this goes in the future. I'd honestly like to give the Linux Linuxulator another look and see if I can get it to work and see what games I can personally get going because I think this could be really, really impressive. I'd also be interested to see if the Hummer project or anyone like it tried to integrate this as it would be a really good way to get a strong library of games on BSD. But that's all I have to say for this video. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.